The two top seeds in Division I battling for the section title. Jesuit, the defending champs, Whitney with first serve. And that's how this match gets started on the Jake Hay ace. The Marauders answer right back. Colin Marks on the mark to Vince Semin. But Jesuit would go down by a couple of points. Mason Miller to Hay to Tucker Wagnon. 8-6, Whitney leads it in the first. Marauders rally for the lead. Marks digs it. Lorenzo Crisol sets up Rocky Brazier and Rocky says, let's go. 24-22 set point for Jesuit. Colin Marks puts up the impenetrable wall and the Marauders go on top one set to none. Second set, not as close as the first. Jesuit goes up by eight after Keegan McManus hammers it down for the kill. Then it's McManus and John Downey teaming up for the block and the defending champs are now just one set away from a repeat. But the Wildcats aren't going anywhere. Riley Smith to Hay. Then Cale Cochran, the kill from the back row. Whitney would lead it by as many as six. But Jesuit erases the Whitney lead. Crisol, Marks, John Downey, and we have a Marauder passed out. The set is side at 19. Cochran, then Hay with a quick set to Cody Hansen, and that one isn't coming back. Hey, on over to Smith. Riley ties the setup at 21 on the trick shot down the baseline. But the Marauders back on top by one. Marks to the hard hitting Vince Semin, and it hits off the tape and down in cat territory. Now 24 22 match point for the Marauders. Marks, Griffin Hurd, and I think you heard Jesuit is the back to back. Sack Joaquin section Division I champs hoist the banner and throw on the hats. Jesuit with a perfect postseason winning all five matches, three sets to none. It just goes to show how much hard work we really put into it as a team. Like, it's much harder to do it a second time because you got that pressure of comparing to last season. But, you know, we wanted it really badly. And this team has worked so hard to get to this position. And once we were here, we had no doubt in our mind that this was our game. Let's go.